It was a full day of work for the staff at Ohio Stadium here today as two athletic contests played out on the turf here in the shoe. The number 11 Ohio State men's lacrosse team hosted the number three ranked Maryland Terrapins to whom they fell by a final tally in overtime 10 to 9. It was followed by the spring game, of course, annual tradition for the Buckeye football team to split into two factions, Scarlet versus Gray. The Gray team led by Cardale Jones emerged victorious by a score of 17 to 14 over his red counterparts led by Stephen Collier. Although the Buckeyes still have many key contributors from last year's championship season sideline and convalescing from injury, those who were healthy got their chance to scrimmage in front of a crowd of over 99,000 people Saturday. Wide receiver Corey Smith hauled in two touchdown receptions on downfield passes of 58 and 37 yards from Jones, who ended up 19 of 42 on the day, and two interceptions, one of which was made by safety Tyvis Powell. The two shared a selfie-worthy moment on the sideline after Jones tackled Powell on the return. Despite a slow start for the Scarlet team, Collier found his rhythm and delivered a 35-yard scoring strike to Terry McLaurin to conclude the first half. He was also responsible for a handoff to Paris Campbell for a score at the end of the third quarter. And while the spring game may revolve somewhat around getting players who are young or who may have been previously redshirted or low on the depth chart some valuable experience, that doesn't mean Urban Meyer is satisfied with his Buckeyes just yet. 99,000 people, I think I heard that over the PA system. Now, I'm not surprised, but extremely uh, grateful to come watch a scrimmage. At times, not a very pleasant scrimmage. As I just told our players this, we did not improve as a team. That was not a good team out there. Uh, but we did individually get better. This is a critical offseason for us. This is really critical. Because, uh, like I said, we did not improve. No, it's no one's fault. How do you get better as a team when half your team is not playing? Defensive end Sam Hubbard, offensive tackles Chase Ferris and Billy Price, and wideout Noah Brown were among the players Meyer praised for having had strong spring showings. So although the football team is done here at Ohio Stadium for the foreseeable future until the kickoff of the 2015 season, doesn't mean we don't have plenty to talk about with some of the reserves and action that players saw during this annual spring game. Until next season, for Lantern TV, I'm Andrew Todd Smith.